Hey folks, it's Kate Cordaro from Two River Theater. Um, how you holding up? You doing okay? We have some great theater uh, exercises and a wonderful experience for you to see. So I'm here to talk to you about our A Little Shakespeare program. It's our education program that we've done since uh, 2014. Um, and this is where we do a 75 minute, 75 to 90 minute cut of a Shakespeare play. It is directed and designed by theater professionals and it's performed and supported backstage by high school students. And last year we did Little Shakes Macbeth and, uh, and we're gonna put that on YouTube for you so that you can see that um, if you missed it in person. And I have some exercises here to go along with that production. Uh, two of them can be done before you see the show and one of them is uh, discussion questions for afterwards. Uh, but I'll set those up in a sec. I hope you enjoy. I hope you're hanging in there. Wash your hands. Take care. Eat a brownie, you know. All of these activities were written by Gina Grandy as part of our curriculum guide for A Little Shakespeare Macbeth. This first exercise is called Playing with Rhythm, and it's all about uh, Shakespeare's use of iambic pentameter, which is explained fully in the exercise, and uh, when it is used and when it isn't, and what that means. Enjoy. So the second exercise is called Quotes Out of Context, and it's just that. It's uh, some quotes from the play that have no context. See if you can figure out what they mean. Um, they're full of imagery and, um, and delicious language, uh, but they can have some pretty straightforward meanings. Um, my favorite example of this is when I was prepping to do a pre-show workshop for Little Shakes Macbeth, um, going to visit a group of third graders, a, a class of third graders. And so my son was in third grade. And so I decided to run some of these by him first. And so I gave him the quote, where we are, there's daggers in men's smiles. And I asked him what that meant. And he thought for a second and he said, it's like they're nice, but then when they turn around, if they had a mustache, they'd be like, the kid's a genius. Uh, have fun. This third exercise is simply some discussion questions for after you have seen the show. I hope they make you think. I hope they start some good discussions within your family or your household or over Zoom with all of your friends that you're gonna do these exercises with. Um, enjoy, take care, see you soon. <laughs> 